Hey guys, I just noticed when building this new project for my e-bike that there's not much information out there on using an ESP32 and connecting it up to a VSC using UART. All you really need is these two wires here going to pretty much any I.O. pin and power and ground. Please ignore the little GPS unit that's hanging around back there that is for the other project. But as you can see, it all works. I'm only just getting voltage and current here, but you can get a whole lot more information off the VESC. Now let's jump into the code and see how it's done. At this part, we just include the library. This is the VSC UART library from SolidGeek. You can find it on GitHub. The next part, we just create a variable and attach it to this library. Next part is the setup. My VSC, I program to use this board rate, so I made sure to put it here. Then, because I use an Arduino Nano ESP32, it's, the pinout's a little bit different. I'll just put it up here now so you can see that I use D12 and D11, but this will be different if you're using like a standard ESP32 development board. This is the last bit of the code, is just in the main loop where we have an if statement to make sure the ESP32 and the VSC are talking to each other. And then from there, we can grab the variables we want. Now there's a much bigger list of information that you can pull from the VSC as well as information that you can push to the ESC. But for my purposes, this is all we need and this kind of gets you set up and gets you started. Now we connect our VSC to the computer and we're going to configure it to send the data via UART to our ESP32. In the VSC tool, just make sure that you have this selected as UART and whatever accelerator input you are using. I had to use the hardware serial and not the, the normal serial port on the ESP32. It just didn't work for me. So this is a small description of how you set up the hardware serial and how it can be configured. You can pretty much use any of the GPIO pins, which makes it super versatile for your projects. Just wanted to make this really short and easy because I noticed there was quite a few people on forums asking questions on how to do this and how to connect up an ESP32 to a VSC because there was absolutely no information about it. 